What's up, y'all? It's Laquisha, and I'm back with another one. Y'all hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you never miss a video that I post. So, y'all, the word on the street was after Shamar and Alvo had got engaged, Shamar had Alvo delete everything of him off his page. And so did Shamar. Shamar has nothing about his fiance on his page. So, y'all, Tommy, which is Alvo's ex-boyfriend, fake ex-boyfriend for social media to get clout over, gathered some fake evidence, honey, and put it together and made a video. <laughs> I want y'all to listen to what Tommy had to say about this whole them deleting each other off their page. What's up, y'all? Y'all already know what's going on, girl. The tea has been spilling, and girl, when I tell you, baby, it's like pop, 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 pop coins. Baby, why the f*** did Elvo just take all them videos down off his page, baby? And word on the street that Shamar said he was done with Elvo because he felt like Elvo was clap chasing him. Shamar said he didn't have the D-I-C key, so he said he had to go, go, go. But I don't know where street it was on. It might be at the zoo. It might be at a carnival. But baby, Shamar said he was done. Shamar said he don't need Elvo. Because Elvo was doing nothing but leeching him anyway, girl. You ain't here for me. Go look at it and check that yourself. Because I don't have to lie. Everything I tell y'all is proof facts and you see it. Elvo took every video out because Shamar sent him a cease and desist. And with that cease and desist, it say, you cannot post me without my knowledge. And you cannot post me without me telling you to post me. And girl, right on the street, that Elvo had to take every video down. Shamar took the husband out of his bio too. Because you remember, Shamar just had Elvo as his husband in the bio. Girl, the rest was fake. The marriage was fake. The proposal was fake. Everything was fake for some TikTok views. And now you back at square one. What happened to you was doing? You the big, big boss. You big shot caller now. Huh, Elvo? You ain't got no more clout now. So what you gonna do now? Who your next fake relationship? That was talking about me. Talking about some other I look desperate. No, her mama look desperate. Fake. And he going to jail for cutting the, the disabled people. I'm gonna make sure I leave him locked up because why would you sit right there and engage to that man and you know damn well you don't really wanna engage that man. Then you gonna engage with a man like the motherfucking bubble gun, 25 cent machine green. That's fucked up. You need to stop your shit. If you're going to propose to him, you should have got the, took the money out of his account and bought him a real ring from K Jewelry. But you went around here giving him a motherfucking uh, 25 cent bubble gun ring and trying to propose to him for some little TikTok clout. Girl, you better get invested in your money and invest in your session. You better watch out for him. He's a con artist. A con the fuck artist. <laughs> It ain't funny, y'all. It ain't funny. I'll be up there trying not to laugh, but that boy be cracking me up, okay? But the thing is, supposedly, none of that is true, okay? <laughs> So I went on ahead and went on Alvo on Shamar's uh, page just to see what they were talking about. So y'all listen to this video. Why even please, 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 please don't get it twisted. I'm still the boyfriend, boo. Always gonna be the boyfriend. Just come post my people on my page. Don't mean nothing going on. We cool. I just don't. I just don't want my stuff on the public no more. I ain't got time for all that. Y'all too negative. Y'all do too much. Y'all got too much going on. Y'all need to focus on the star. Y'all need to focus on Big Marco. Like y'all need to focus on Big Marco. Focus on his career, what he got going on. So don't think that oh he's over mm -hmm. with. Cause my boo still here, ain't he? Mm -hmm. He's still here. He just ain't gonna be seeing no videos. You feel me? Y'all too much. Y'all too negative. So please don't listen to Gary Coleman going screaming and hollering at his phone, telling y'all he got the tea. He ain't got nothing. He ain't even got his child. But never more, nevertheless. Happy on Monday, y'all. I already said that on last day. <laughs> I said oh, I ain't worried about nobody that can't oh, take care of their child and all this oh, got custody. Y'all, I'm no longer posting my boyfriend on my page no more. I'm sorry, it's just too much going on. It's too many snakes around him. It's too many weird people doing weird stuff. And I just feel like I'm too much of a good person and I don't want my name connected to nothing that's gonna make me look like a bad person or make me look crazy. So, you feel me? I'm sorry to everybody who supporting us and who, who loving us and who fucking with us. But I'm, I can't, I can't do content with him no more. I can't do content on my page. I, I can't do none of that. And I can't tell y'all why. Really, I don't even know why. He don't even know why, to be honest. But I can't do content with him no more. Y'all ain't gonna be able to see no more of me and him. You feel me? But the best thing about it is I still can be able to love on him. I can still be able to be around him. And I can still be able to love on him in privately. You feel me? So 
to everybody who was loving us together and who was rocking with us and supporting us. I'm sorry, y'all, but I can't do no more content with him. How y'all feel about that whole thing of him having to delete Shamar off his page and Shamar deleting him off of his page? I just want to know, do y'all feel like they being honest to the public or y'all just feel like something happened to where Shamar just spoke his feelings like, nah, I feel like a whole bunch of people doing crazy things in my life as for using me. So let's just chill on posting me for a while. I don't know. Everything seemed kind of weird to me. Shamar's fiance Alva also speak of why he dates Shamar. He don't only date Shamar for his looks, but he date Shamar because of how Shamar treats him and everything he could do with Shamar. I want to be with somebody that can love me out loud and love me in privately as well. That's all I wanted. And now that I got somebody I can be myself with, talk to, go on picnic with, do little corny stuff with, vent to, hell, gossip with, that's all I ever wanted. Like, I'm literally dating my best friend. <laughs> like, What's wrong with that? I never felt like people should never explain how they feel about a person or why they F with somebody. Like, if you fuck with somebody and you want to be with that person, be with them. I feel like the reason why a lot of y'all single and y'all not in a relationship and y'all not married yet is because y'all keep on trying to date off of how, how society feel and not off of how you feel and what's right for you. You feel me? I date on what's right for me how a person make me feel and how a person move me spiritually, emotionally. Y'all need to, like, I'm dating for love, not for financial. Because one thing about me, I can't fake it. I fuck with you, I fuck with you, I don't, I don't. You never been in between with me, but I. Right. So I snuck that video in there because a lot of people been thinking like, is this all fake? Like, is this a scam? Cause it seemed like it's good acting on Alvo part. And cause y'all know Shamar is so used to dudes being all over him. But this one is by far the, I ain't gonna say it, but y'all know what I'm thinking. Anyway, so that was in there for y'all because this man said he can't fake relationships. He can't fake the fuck with somebody. But who knows, he did the same thing with Tommy. Mm -hmm. But anyway, this next video is Shamar basically saying, y'all need to stop clocking her man T. I just mad because y'all man cheat on y'all and Shamar man don't. <laughs> he is on his own line making his money. Why y'all trying to sit up here and say, oh, he using you, he doing it? Come on now, y'all ain't said that. Y'all ain't said that with the bitch up there was goddamn using me when she was taking all my motherfucking money. Y'all ain't clock that. So don't try to clock him. Clock auntie. If that's the okay. case, I'm trying to come for him and think that he ain't wrong when he's not. This man, this man ain't doing nothing but at my house. Chilling with me. Love what are y'all doing? What are y'all man at? Why y'all man ain't at home chilling with y'all? Why y'all man ain't at home cooking for y'all? Why y'all man ain't uh, at home putting pockets? I mean, putting money in your pocket. Cause he out there cheating on you with somebody else. You better clock that. <laughs> clock that. I know that's right, Shamar. <laughs> anyway, y'all, let me know how y'all feel about this video. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm out. Peace.